The Bucknell soccer programs enjoyed a successful weekend of hosting Patriot League foes as the women's team won twice, including a 2-0 whitewashing of Army on Sunday, and the men's team battled to a 1-1 draw with visiting Navy. In the men's game, Brendan Bergdorf pushed the Bison in front with about 27 minutes left in the first half. Plump as Meyer actually heads that one ahead. Nicely done as they try to send in Bergdorf. He's got a good first touch here. He's in the area with two defenders and he sets it into the netting. Nice play there by Brendan Bergdorf. We were targeting Jesse a lot who is our forward and I think that's definitely one of the keys for us. So he got the ball and I was able to run on past him and he laid me a nice ball and I was uh, able to take a couple touches and uh, get a lucky bounce to have it end up in the goal. Although he wasn't pleased that Navy tied the game up late in the first half, head coach Brendan Nash was ecstatic that his team held off the deep Navy squad in overtime. And in the overtime, that was just helter-skelter for 20 straight minutes, and we had chances, they had chances, and I'm sure uh, their coach was just as nervous as I was, but all in all, I think a 1-1 was a fair result. In Sunday's women's game against the other service academy, Army, Bucknell struck first with a Cassie Roses Dinger goal. Dinger goes around her and scores the opening goal of the match. What a pass through to Cassie Dinger, who scores. Dinger, her third goal of the year, and the Bison are on top. 31-35 left on the clock in the first half. That was followed by an incredible post-colliding header by Courtney Nelson. Sending a ball through ahead, beautiful one to Dornick. She sends a cross in over the head. Nelson with a diving header and scores. What a cross first by Dwarnik. An even better finish for Nelson, who scores and then collides into the post. Aggressive play there and a gutsy play just to try to get her head on it. And the Bison have doubled their lead. It's 2 to nothing. The tie with Navy leaves the men's team in a tie for fourth place in the Patriot League standings, while the two wins over the weekend by the women moves them into a tie for third.